you're gonna need a couple of, of cups or beakers or, well, you probably don't have beakers at home. So glasses will work, um, mugs would work. If you have two empty soup cans, that would work. Since we're in science, we're gonna use two beakers. You need about 16 inches of aluminum foil, a candle, a votive, a small candle, and then about 10 chocolate chips for this, okay? The first thing you're gonna do is take the aluminum foil and you're gonna fold it in half. And we're gonna build a bridge. So we want it thin, but we want it strong. So we're gonna fold it in half again. So that's two times in half, and now one more time. So that's in half three times. So now we've got this little bridge of aluminum foil, okay? So we're gonna take our, our beakers or cups or glasses, whatever you've got, and we are going to, you can do this. I um, like to kind of do, do this. Okay, so it's nice and flat. And then the first time we're gonna put the candle under um, the bridge and put it on one side, okay? It can be left, it can be right, but you put it right up next to the glass or the beaker, okay? Then you're gonna take five chocolate chips and you're gonna put them on oops, this bridge. So two on the ends, one in the middle, and then halfway, and halfway, okay? So if I like this candle, or when I like this candle, which chocolate chip do you think is gonna melt first? Which one's gonna melt last? Okay, so go ahead and pause this video and uh, make your prediction. All right, I'm gonna light the candle. And we're just gonna observe the chocolate chips and see which one melts first, which one melts second. Find out what order they melt in. You can see this one is already, look at the color is changing from white, so our chocolate chips are in the cupboard over the summer, and when they get, when chocolate gets warm, the wax will come out to the surface and then uh, cool and harden and dry, and that, so that's why they're, they're white, but you can see as it's getting melted, it's going from white to brown. All right, so this one's almost totally melted, um, this one is three quarters of the way. It's just the very top. And you can see that this one has started to melt as well. Okay. So how is the heat moving so that this one melts first, this one melts second, this one melts third? Okay. Where do you see heat by radiation? Where do you see heat by conduction? Where do you heat, see heat by convection? All right, so in this um, setup, this time, we're gonna put the candle in the middle, okay? And so I want you to predict, okay, so when the candle is on, when I light the candle, is how's the heat gonna move, okay? Is it gonna go to the left? Or is it gonna to go to the right? Or is it gonna go both directions? Okay, so pause the video and record your, um, record your predictions. All right, so here we go, gonna light the candle. I have the urge to sing a song. There's a song about lighting a candle. All right, so 
So you see that middle one is starting to melt already. So is it going to go left or is it going to go right? Oh, look at that one is melting. Oh, but that one is too. So what does that mean for the heat? That one looks like it's starting to melt and so does that one. So on your slide or in your notebook, write down your observations. Which direction did the heat go?